Hello, my name is Aran and welcome to my channel. Today I would like to talk to you about a monk subclass that I wrote. Its origins date back to when I played Pathfinder and I played a monk there. And then I found out about the Unchained classes and rebuilt it as an Unchained monk and I really really loved it. The deal with the Unchained monk is that you can pick and choose your abilities however you want and you had a lot of powers to choose from, so that way you can customize your monk however you want with your selection of powers, and you can do it all with one class. And that's something that is especially missing for me in D&D, which I hope will be rectified in the future with those optional class features. But in the meantime, here's my monk way of the Unchained. What I did with this subclass is take the spirit of the Unchained monk from Pathfinder and try to work it into D&D 5e. The main idea of this subclass is the advanced key powers and the style strikes. If you've played the Unchained Monk in Pathfinder, you should be familiar with those. I also tried to port in the high-level features from the Monk, and hopefully still make it cool even at its base. And because the Monk's capstone feature sucks, I remade it as something that I think would be cooler, and is represented in the Monk class in Pathfinder. So these are the basic features of the Monk subclass. The next few pages outline your choice of advanced key powers and style strikes. Advanced key powers can be something passive, like blind fighting, that gives you blind side of 10 feet when you still have key points, or you could do something active like bike dance fighting which attacks everyone around you, or something like combat reflexes that gives you another opportunity attack. If you like a kind of ranged monk then you might want to try out deflect boulders which increases and enhances your deflect missile ability, or something like impeccable throw which improves your throwing weapons. I always like to have a way to improve the critical success of an attack. Deny Death and Jaunt were two of my favorite abilities in Pathfinder, in the Unchained Monk. And I'm sure if you play the Monk in Pathfinder, you can't have it without the Diamond features. Elemental Fury and Elemental Burst allows you to charge up your Monk attacks with elemental damage. Medusa's Wrath is a classic that allows you to add an attack if you're flurrying against a disabled opponent. Ravager is a cool power I like that lets you get better as you kill your enemies. And Shared Memory is also one of my favorite features, which allows you to communicate memories from your mind to their mind. I had to have somatic adept in there because you needed a way to be even more physically capable than you usually are. And Weave Slingshot is another one of my favorites because I like ways to turn magic back around on itself. Style strikes are a way to add some style to your regular attacks by doing things that are special. Things like choking out your opponent until they're unconscious, or judo throwing them over your hip, or a karate classic like sweep the leg. These features allow you to customize your monk to be a wrestler a grappler, a ranged attacker, melee specialist, mage slayer, or anything else you want. That's it, I hope you enjoyed this quick look, and I would appreciate it if you check it out on the DMs Guild and maybe buy it for yourself. The link will be in the description. Thank you very much for watching, until next time, stay good, have fun.